Honestly, I'm pretty happy by this. I'm happy to see something more of ReZero Season 3 because, my gosh, I will say it right now, it's going to be peak. ReZero at its highest point. Then again, I mean, the web novel has shown pretty highs and lows right now with Arc 7 and 8 and this season covering Arc 5 and for sure Arc 6, we just, I just don't know how much it might cover, but... I will still say it is peak. Fuck, even the music from this new trailer that dropped, like, it's pretty damn good. And here's a fun fact, 90 minutes for one episode. Now, that is a lot of content that can be covered in 90 minutes. Now, the editing for that might be a bit of a bitch, but I am willing to take the plunge because it's ReZero. I love ReZero. ReZero has inspired me in different ways. As well as to go back into writing, which I start with fan fiction writing. I am doing an original story at some point. It's just still needs a little work, which, by the way, uh, I'll, I'll show right now what are my ReZero related fan fictions. I, I, I suggest a little read. I mean, it, it's not the best, but it, it, it's something. Anyway, that's derailing the point. The point is we're here to talk about what we just saw with the new trailer. Serious. The Sin Archbishop of wrath her voice actress pretty god tier that is some god tier voice acting i the way she is like speaking gets my attention because obviously it sounds like she's insane which she kind of is and then we get some shots with subaru beatrice garfield running on the side we get the city of Pristello, the Watergate city, and then we get more stuff with Amelia and uh, an interesting uh, design choice that they chose to go with. And then we get more stuff that leads into how they ended up in the city of Pristella. Like, we get actual shots from what is essentially going to be episode one with all the royal candidates with their knights, a bunch of interesting visuals. We get Reinhardt and Wilhelm. A nice, interesting little flashback, which is related to those two. Garfield and his now alive the mother, which is going to be one hell of a shock for most. Liliana and her anime form. We have a lot of honestly wholesome moments. I do not think there's anything unwholesome. Hell, auto drinking was kind of funny because i mean we did see him drink and kind of be all buzzy at the end of season two and it's funny because when you think about auto drinking it's mostly because he's just in fucking stress mode and then we get the motherfucker himself regulus the piece of shit touching amelia like you can fuck off my dude but yeah that this is what i call season one season three episode one preview of shit that's gonna happen and look i think episode one is going to be one of the more wholesome episodes before everything goes to utter shit the thing about this season it's going to be the most action-filled season compared to seasons one and two and i am just excited this season i will say it once again is going to be peak re-zero i can guarantee it